Hello, today let's talk about interesting problem. So uh, when we have Magic Grid or any project, we have the content diagram for that project to navigate through the project, right? And that's like almost like must for any project, but uh, it is manually created, right? So people are asking, you know, can you do it automatically? So you see here Magic Grid based content diagram, right? And here is automatic one based on the table. So how to create the table? As you see here, the diagrams uh, are queried. So this table is based on the structure. The structure is custom. So we want the custom structure based on Magic Grid, let's say Magic Grid. So we created the, the custom profile uh, for that. The stereotype is domain applied only the, on the packages which we want to see here. And then we show the type of that domain element like uh, stereotype here so we query that automatically and now the uh, columns are based on the queries again so we here you see that first query and all of them are identical just the queries querying different stereotype at the derived property for requirements and you see here we are doing two things first of all we are looking with the simple expression for owned elements like simple navigation we look for owned elements owned elements uh, element and then we are using that simple navigation defined as a scope we just drag it on the scope here use it as input to find and we look for all the diagrams which like type of the this diagram see which would have custom stereotype uh, applied and that stereotype depends on the column so in the first column is requirements right so it is custom requirement uh, stereotype you see apply stereotype requirement uh, and here we have um, name of the column requirements and they have those different stereotypes like re behaviors parametric requirements uh, structured because we want to identify specifically which diagram we want to see and we want to see on the don't content diagrams so if we see those content diagrams they have those stereotypes applied so if it is requirements type like it doesn't matter would it be like user needs would it be you know stakeholder requirements or you know uh, system requirements or system requirements if it has this stereotype we can query and we get results as you can see here black box stakeholder needs solution domain we have system requirements subsystem one has a behavior system subsystem requirements and then navigation is pretty much we double click here select the diagram and we can right click open diagram and that's how navigation works if we want we can close it we can uh, see this dynamic table and if you will create new one you know just don't forget to apply stereotype content diagram apply stereotype and it will be represented here let's say for example subsystem 2 behaviors okay subsystem 2 has behaviors let's create a diagram content diagram and let's uh, apply stereotype create a stereotype content behavior applied go back refresh and now we have subsystem diagram. So that's how now the automatic navigation uh, is created for the project content. Uh, and that could be applied for any domain, uh, any methodology, not only Magic Grid.